We are here today at the Little Briar Gap Trail. It's four miles out and back, and you get 465 feet in elevation gain. Along this trail are some really neat historical structures, such as the Little Greenbrier Schoolhouse, these, an old cemetery, and the Walker Sister Homestead. We'll give you some more history along the way, so let's get going. right behind me is the Little Green Briar School. It was built in 1882. It was also used uh, by a local Primitive Baptist congregation for church services and they established the cemetery right behind me as well. The last classes that were held in this school were in 1935. So, in 1870, John and Margaret Walker moved to the homestead, and they grew their family to include 11 children. They expanded the homestead to include the cabin, a barn, a corn crib, an apple house, a smoke house, a spring house, a blacksmith shop, a tub mill, and a pig pen. But the only remaining structures today are the cabin, the corn crib, and the spring house. In 1909, John Walker deeded 
the 123-acre farm to his youngest son, Giles, and five of his daughters, Margaret, Martha, Louisa, Hetty, and Nancy. Giles later uh, deeded his portion of the farm to his five sisters. The sisters lived here and maintained a self-reliant lifestyle after the modernization that followed World War I. In the 1930s, the Great Smoky Mountain Park Commission tried to convince the sisters to sell their land. They refused. The park superintendent sent a letter to the National Park Service stating, These old women are rooted to the soil. If we were to eject them from the park, then we would receive severe criticisms, and justly so. The sisters were permitted to live out the rest of their lives on their homestead. And in 1964, the last sister passed, Louisa, and then the Park Service assumed control of their land and the remaining structures were put on the National Register of Historic Structures. Alright guys, so that was the Little Briar Gap Trail to the Walker Sisters home. There wasn't really much to the trail, it's relatively easy at 4 miles. You just follow along the Little Briar Branch stream all the way to the Walker Sisters home. It's really great to see some preserved history along the trail. We really enjoyed it and we hope y'all enjoyed following along. If you haven't already, subscribe and hit that notification bell to follow along for more of our adventures. Thank you for watching.